The journey was started in uh, year 2015. At that time, uh, ISPs were not sharing uh, local traffic with uh, uh, each other and uh, all web traffic was going to international route which was taking uh, much time and uh, cost was very high because uh, ISPs and, and end users has to pay international band, uh, bandwidth charges and uh, there was no, not a uh, level playing field, especially for the small operators. ISOC cooperated with the PTA. They conducted a seminar with the uh, PTA when uh, we gathered all stakeholders from academia and uh, uh, bandwidth providers, ISPs and mobile operators uh, in this room. And at that time, we conducted a survey. So international, when uh, a same website was accessed from the international ra uh, round trip time, so it took uh, around 140 uh, milliseconds, whereas the same website took around 1 to 2 milliseconds. So it was a great opportunity for the local community to access local websites very quickly. We are uh, grateful to ISOC for providing technical support for the IXP. And uh, we, since we have not charged uh, from any of the operators, and uh, equipment has been provided by ISOC, technical support has been uh, provided by the ISOC. So it is, uh, uh, benefit is going to the end user. वजह से हमारे पाकिस्तान में पूरी दुनिया में इतना बड़ा बदलाव आया है कि हमारी पूरी टीचिंग और लर्निंग जो है वो पूरी इंटरनेट पर ट्रांसफर हो गई है शुरू शुरू में हमें बड़ी प्रॉब्लम हुई कि हमारे बच्चे बहुत छोटे हैं उनको पढ़ाना बहुत मुश्किल होता है और ऑनलाइन बच्चे पढ़ने के लिए बिल्कुल भी रेडी नहीं होते लेकिन अल्लाह का शुक्र है हमारे पास इंटरनेट की इतनी अच्छी बेटर क्वालिटी आई है कि हम वो सब चीजें हमारे लिए पॉसिबल हो सकी और हमने वो सब अचीव किया so one of the main advantage that uh, Pakistan University is getting to hosting IXP in Pakistan is that different university portals that hosted in Pakistan are you now universities can access easily. So previously, they, if they have to access any local hosted site, they need to go to the internet. They use international bandwidth. No, they reduce. They have all the services hosted locally, and especially they are connected on Pakistan Education Research Network. So in this way, in the intranet network, they can access all the services and portal. So in the education sector, IXP have pay up key roles to improve the efficiency to access the resources. So it's very beneficial for the universities. I really like online classes. I get to learn new things. I also listen to my teacher and it doesn't feel like that I'm not in physical class. It just feels like a physical class. I get to meet my friends every day because uh, every day is online classes except the weekends. And also I get to meet the, my teachers, my new teachers as I just got upgraded from my grade. And it's really fun. And I also get to do a lot of new homeworks. I also do homeworks on my computer on Google Docs and it is really interesting and fun. Ever since 2017 came about, we experienced a rapid change with how we uh, used to provide the experience for our users. Since 2017, I mean afterwards, um, we've been able to integrate our systems with different supporting or peripheral um, websites and uh, integrations with different programs, third-party applications that provide a better experience for our users, mainly because we were able to reduce the response time ever since these IXPs were installed in Karachi, Lahore, and Islamabad. The 
Cybernet since realized this, we are into industry last 20, 30 years. So we realized that this is very, very important, not only for Cybernet, but it's very important for the countries from the digitization perspective. It's very, very important for industry. So that's why we realized and we started this couple of years ago, this uh, Internet Exchange Point, and we wanted to support. So, so, so we formed that and we started this Internet Exchange Point from Islamabad, where most of the ISPs and mobile operators joined. And we could see a, a, a tremendous difference because the local content they were exchanging so that, that's, that's a benefit which um, we all are missing uh, right now. And uh, yes, uh, Islamabad Internet Exchange Point, we could see the growth of traffic and we can even exchange local emails and local website can be accessible. So in case of, for example, any, any submarine cut, we can still access those websites or those, con those content which are hosted locally on the Internet Exchange Point. Mm -hmm.